Hello, boys and girls. This is Mrs. Simon. I wanted to go over how to sign into your Google account from home. It's a little bit different than what it is from school. At school, typically, we just have Chromebooks. We open it up and we sign in um, very easily. And a lot of times your teachers will have account cards for you in front of you. At home, it can be a little bit tricky, depending on what device you're using. Um, everybody needs to try to find the Google sign in page from the device that you're using. If you're using a Chromebook, it'll automatically be there. But from any other device, you'll have to actually, in the search bar, search for Google Sign In. And then you should get something similar to this when you do that. Now for Bay City Public Schools, every student has an email account and a Google account already created for you. However, the district has not turned on the email access for elementary students. So even though you have an email account, you cannot technically get into email. But it does allow you to get into your Google Drive and access many programs that your students, that your teachers have synced with your Google account. So to sign in, it's a formula. You need five letters of your last name, three letters of your first name, your graduation year, and then at home, you have to add at bcschools.net. And then your password is your school ID, which is typically six digits. However, in Google, you need eight digits to sign in. So you need to add two zeros to the beginning of your student ID. To find all of this information, your parents can go or you can go into your Skyward account. And I have gotten permission from Mr. Laser and Mrs. Laser to use Haley's um, profile page from the parent view of Skyward, but I blocked out all of their personal information. So this is Haley's email address, and if you can see, it follows the formula. Her school ID is called Other ID, and it's right here, and her graduation year is here as well. So for Haley, it's L-E-A-S-U, five letters of her last name, H-A-I, three letters of her first name, 2029, the year she graduates, and then at bcschools.net. Her password, which of course I've changed, is 12345 with two beginning zeros to make it eight characters. And that simply is how you would sign in from home to access your Google account in your Google Classroom and many other programs that your teachers have set up that are synced. I hope this is helpful. Have a beautiful day. Thank you.